that I'm aware of. Oh, okay, so... Uh, I think he's talking about 131. Oh, 131? Um, yeah. I think so? I think he's, uh, doing, uh, I think he's doing a 212 right now. Yeah, I last saw him with, uh, Beard Fassa. Uh, Beard they're Fassa? just being a romantic couple. Can you call him for me, please? <laughs> Um, yeah, do you want to give me just a minute? Okay, thank you so much. Direct. Tell Miss Wyatt. Hey, are you guys on a call by any chance? Can you give me a call at 780? Mister, can you keep an eye on my scooter or my golf cart with my puppy? Yeah, I can do that. Thank you so much. Hey, it's Troy. Hey, I got Wyatt here over at 1036 on Home Drive at the 24-7. He said he wants to talk to you. I guess it's urgent. Tell him it's the stalker guy. Uh, he said something about a stalker guy. All right, copy that. Yep, yes, sir. Yeah, I just figured it'd be more like better to, to call him on the phone than on the radio. Try to keep the lines clear. Yeah, no, you're a lifesaver. Yeah, I'll go ahead and uh, I'll sit tight with you, all right? Yeah, so not too long ago, this guy tried to get me out front of here uh, in a black van. He had me go around back with him. He said he had beer to unload, and there was no boxes, and he pointed a gun at me and tried to take me captive. Okay. And then he tried a beer truck. And that didn't work. And then he tried to hit me, and Red saved the day. I, I opened my own can of whoop on him, though, but Red had saved the day, and now I'm scared. He just called me and said he's out of jail. Oh, okay. I don't know how he got my number. I'm not sure either. But... I don't want to do this again. I understand. I'm going to get, uh, I'm going to get one, I'm going to get him down here to help you out, all right? Okay, I appreciate your help. What's your name? Uh, I'm Deputy Troy Baines. Troy, you're my best friend. Yeah, actually, you, I think you talked with me earlier uh, a while back, a few days ago, when you were riding with uh, Boom. Yeah, probably. You guys are all my best friends. <laughs> I appreciate it, man. You're my biggest best friend right now. Oh, I'm just just here doing a job, man. Yeah, but your biggest friend, your best biggest best friend, because you're saving my life. Oh, I got you, man. I always try to look out for. Look out for those who need help. Yeah, I seem to be a magnet for trouble. Damn, I love everybody. Everybody's so nice. Wyatt! Red, dude! What's going on? Dude, the guy called me! What guy? The stalker, you remember? Oh, yeah. from like a few weeks ago? Yeah, that guy that tried to kidnap me. What, uh, what, <laughs> what did he say? He said he's out of jail and he's f trying to find me. Oh no. Oh. I don't remember his name either. Do no, I don't even Wyatt? No, I don't even think I ever got his name. I just know he was always driving a black vehicle or a beer truck and then I think he was wearing all black and had orange or yellow hair. Yeah, I oh, God, I can't remember what he was wearing. I I don't Hold on. I don't even remember how he got my phone number. This is all weird. Red! Red! Hey, Wyatt, what's going on, buddy? This guy's calling me right now. What guy? The stalker. Should I answer it? Can you put it on speaker? Uh, I, I, I don't know. Uh, just kind of repeat what he says. Go ahead, answer. Hello? See you, Wyatt. You see me? I see you. Where do you see me? Why? I just want to hang out. Oh, well then come over 24-7 and hang out with me. Oh, silly. There are cops there. You see cops here? Hey, Fred. Oh, yeah, I see them. I need a, Don't worry. Are they your best friends? Hey, yes, all the cops are my best hey, friends. Hey, dude, I would love... No, they I will. I would love to they dance with you, man. But we got a little what do you mean they won't be my best friend for long? You're not gonna kill. Uh, he just said he's gonna kill you guys. Uh, 
412. Who is this guy? He was a stalker not too long ago. Uh, Red helped me. He he tried to kidnap me in the back of the 24-7 here. And he put in a gun to my head. And I opened the biggest can of whoop on him and I took off. And then he showed up in a beer truck because, you know, I like beer. So he tried to sucker me in with that. And I ran from him. And then he was at the flywheels and he followed me and hit me on my scooter and Red was there and took care of him after I whooped him again. But now he just called and he said he's going to kill you guys and he can see us. Yeah, the only thing is I can't remember his name. But he can see us. It was me and there was like two other deputies that showed up. I just, I, I don't remember his name. Where is he that he can see us? I'm not sure. Okay, I'll tell you what, Wyatt. I'm going to put you kind of in protective custody right now, okay? Okay, what about Snuffleupagus? Can he go with me? Uh, Sure. There's room in the back. Oh, wait. Am I riding with you? Oh, yeah. Uh, Your golf cart's wide open, man. Anybody can oh. take a shot on you. God, I hope he doesn't do nothing to you guys. Uh, I don't think he's going to do anything for us, but we're going to go right down to the station, okay? Okay, listen. I'm telling both of you guys. If he messes with any of you, I don't care what it takes. I am going to crack the biggest can of whoop, and I'm going to take this guy out. I'm done with it. All right, well, let us try to do our job first. You know, keep your hands clean there. Oh, I know. But, all right, we'll take you down to VCSO, and uh, we'll go from there, okay? All right, let's do this. All right. I'm so, going to tell you guys. Come on out. Yep. All right, let's go, what? Okay. All right, go ahead. All right, get in the window. But he keeps locking the door on me. Keep an eye on my dog, sir. He doesn't want to come with. Can you keep an eye on my dog? He doesn't want to come with for some reason. Oh yeah, I can definitely do that. Thank you. You're welcome. Mr. Mr. Snugglesworth. Yeah, Mr. Snuffleupagus. Listen, you might want to tell all the other cops because he's gonna, he said he would kill all my best friends. So, so just the two of us, Wyatt, then me and Beard for say? Oh, I see what you did there. Thank you so much for raising my spirits. Let's go Thank you. Okay. All right, bud, you can have a seat in that chair. Just make yourself feel comfortable. Okay. All right. Try to stay behind this counter, though, for me, okay? Okay. And if you hear a shot, right. you duck down, okay? Actually, why don't I do this? I did this last time. Spot right, good spot for you. You guys promise to be careful. We will. Is anybody staying here? Yeah, we're gonna stick around here, okay? What? Thank you so much, Beer Fasa. No problem. I'm just gonna look out the window, okay? So, yell okay. If you have to get me, okay? All right, I love you. Be careful. All righty. Do you, uh, do you know why this guy's after you in the first place? No, he just kept saying he he wanted to be my best friend and that he's he's stalking me. He's like really creepy and he just wants to try to be my best friend. All right. I don't even know him. It just came out of the blue one day. Interesting. Yeah, there's just there's crazy people. Yeah, he was wearing all black and he remember that day you said not to go to the the one place about the beer. Yeah, 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 I remember that. It was that day. That's what he did. He tried to trick me, and I didn't go over there. So then he showed up in this black van, and he had, like, black clothing on, I think, blonde hair. And he put in front of the 24-7. He asked if I'd help him unload boxes. And you know me, Mr. Beerfist. I'm always so nice. So I said yes. And then 
he pulled a gun on me because there was no boxes there. And luckily, this guy in a blue Ford Focus showed up right as I opened my can of whoop and punched him. And then we took off. Well, you got lucky once, but you know what that means. He's just going to come at you harder. So that's well, why we need to be more com uh, careful. Well, yeah, then he showed up here. I, I was staying here and he showed up in a beer truck and tried to lure me in. And I ran from him and he ditched it at the motel. And then I found him at the flywheels. I was on my scooter, and he ran into me at the guardrail. And luckily, Red was right down the street and came right after him and got him after I opened my can of whoop again and knocked him down. All right. Let me go talk to my other officers here. Sit tight for one second, okay? Beer Fasal, you're the best. Now nah, you're the best, Wyatt. We're going to keep you safe. I appreciate you. Beard! 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 I'll stick in the hey! Uh, hold on. I think he, he's calling. He's, he's calling, calling me. All right, go ahead and answer it and uh, repeat everything he says. Hello? Hi, it. Why are you not answering my phone calls? It took me a while to answer. I'm sorry. I had to figure out how to open the phone. You have poor Snuffleupagus out there by himself. Uh, Mr. Snuffleupagus isn't by himself. On the golf cart? No, he's not on the golf cart. Why? I just, I just saw him. You just saw him on the golf cart at the 24-7? I did. Oh, no, he's not there. Keep lying to me. I'm gonna blow up the golf cart, and I'm gonna take care of Snuffleupagus. You're gonna take care of Snuffleupagus. Mm -hmm. I heard that too. Well, what's your name? Oh, you'll find out. I'll find. I'm gonna go ahead and swing by. He just, he just threatened to kill my dog. He said he could see the 24/7, and then he wouldn't give me my name. He said you'll just find out. All right, hold on one second. What? All right. Why we are getting your dog. Oh, thank you. No problem. You seriously are the best. I can't thank you enough. No problem. We're going to get this guy, what? Beard, I swear to God, I'm a magnet. Well, I want you to stay safe, okay? So you sit back here the whole time. In fact, probably you might want to even lay down. Okay. All right. Alert to the situation. Okay. Yeah, I tried to call Boom, but he said he couldn't do anything. Okay. Everybody's left, Mr. White, so this is the point. I need you to really stay hidden okay okay i'll be quiet too different scenarios why here's what we're gonna do when okay. i tell you to you're gonna stand up you're gonna go stand by your golf cart don't go anywhere i'm right behind you i'm gonna stay out of sight do you understand okay am i just outside Yep, you're just gonna stand outside like oh stay down, stay down. Ah. Stay down, Wyatt. Just stay down. I'm staying down. Do not move, Wyatt. Do not move. I'm not moving. Oh, he's calling me. Answer it. Repeat everything. Hello? Wyatt. Yeah, who's this? It's your best friend. I just took care of one of those cops. You just took care of one of the cops? Yeah, they're gone forever. What do you mean they're gone forever? Where are you at? 
I'm being chased by some of your best friends. I'm going to throw explosives out my window and kill them. You're being chased by my best friends and you're going to throw explosives out the window at them? Yeah. Don't do that. They're nice people. Get down. Get down. No, they're not. They're going to shoot me. What do you mean they're going to shoot you? Because well, I killed Look, all of your best CSO's friends. CSO's under attack right now, okay? Get some but where are you at right now, though? Came back to see you. You're coming back to see me. Wyatt, are you good? But don't, what about yeah. the explosives? Don't be throwing explosives at them. Oh, I think I can probably throw one right through that door, right into the police station. Don't throw one through the door. Oh, I will. I'll what? see you soon, Wyatt. Oh, Wyatt. Why would you do that? We gotta move, Wyatt. If I can't be your only best friend, then no You're one will be right your best friend. Me, you be... He's going to throw explosives at the door, he said, and he's throwing them at the cops. He killed one, he said. He said he was being chased. So they're chasing him, but he said he was going to throw more explosives out the window at him. Get out of here. We got somebody coming by throw explosives at BCSO. Where am I supposed to go? Follow me, Wyatt. Let's go. All right. I hear him. Come on, Wyatt, run. I'm running. Get down, Wyatt. Okay. Stay down, what? I am. Wyatt, they got him, buddy. Who did he hurt? I, I don't know yet, man, but you were my primary concern, Wyatt. I want to make sure you were safe. <laughs> Thank you so much. You are, you're okay, Wyatt. You're going to be okay. Come here, Wyatt, bud. You're going to be okay. That really scared me. Come here, buddy. Yeah, you're okay. You're okay. Why do people keep doing this to me? It's a crazy world, Hyde. It's it's just a crazy world, man. Did he hurt any of my best friends? I don't know. I don't know. I don't think so, though. I think we got him. He may have caused some property damage, but we got him. I don't. As long as you didn't hurt any of my best friends. I think everybody's okay. All right. Okay. He nearly blew my car up. Woo. Oh. Hey, uh, hey, Fortune, can I talk to you over here for a sec? Yeah. Why? Just, just chill out, okay? Okay. Woo. Hey, Wyatt. Wyatt, good news, buddy. Yeah. No officer was injured. None of your oh. people were hurt. Oh my God, that's so good. Gonna be okay, yep. Wyatt. I know. And this guy's going to jail for a very long, long time. <laughs> well, that's where it was last time, and he got out, and he came after me again. To make sure we're gonna stick him away as long as we can this time okay you ever get that guy's name what no he never gave me his name he just said best friend hey, we'll, we'll make sure we get his name and id and all that this time good job there guy you guys are awesome thanks man that's what we're here for You guys are all my best friends, and I couldn't ask for anything else. When this medic's done, I'm probably going to have probably sick and see if we can check on the dude down there. 
Unless they already got county medics taking care of it. All right, what? Well, I'm going to go ahead and we're going to move out to the front, man, because at some point they're going to bring that guy this way. Okay. All right, so let's go this way, bud. All right. Oh, boy. That's a lot of damage. It's okay. I can get a new cart. Well, I mean, the bench is gone. Everything's... Oh, my God. I know. Station's going to be closed for a while. Jesus, people, I swear. Is there... You got any place to stay, man? Any place that might be safe or anything? What? Just my house over in Grapeseed. Okay. Well, I don't have a car right now, but when we get a car, I'll I'll, I'll take you home. Okay. You, okay. You okay, Wyatt. I've been better. Yeah. What? Do I see the craters, man? What happened? It was that same guy. Oh man, the guy in the suit. No, the guy that... Remember last time I opened the can of whoop? Yeah. Yeah, he was out of jail. Oh, God. You know what, Boom? Hmm. It's time. It's time for what? A hug? What? No, it's time for the people who get bullied to stick up for themselves. You know I'm a, I'm a deputy. I can't give you suggestions. You don't have to give me suggestions. I'm just going to stick up for myself from now on. I'll still ask for help, but I'm tired of it. Oh, yeah. This world needs to get rid of all the bullies. Everybody should be nothing but loving, caring, and uh, truthfully just honest and best friends with everybody. Mm -hmm. But not everybody's like that, Wyatt, and that's why we're here. Well, I get that, but that's why I'm fighting back. Just be, take care of yourself. I'm gonna, but I've had enough. Just self-defense is what I'm saying, Boom. All right. You stay safe, Wyatt. I love you. I love you.